Hi, my name is Rebecca and welcome to Yarn and Pajamas. Today is hashtag movie and stitch for the letter M. So I'm going to review the letter M movie, show you guys what I've worked on um, crochet wise, and then announce what my end movie will be. And it is hot as Hades up here today. It's like in the 90s, so of course it's hot up here in my room. So let's just get right on into the movie then. So the movie I watched was The Map of Tiny Perfect Things. I have it right up on IMDb here. So it was made in 2021. It's rated PG-13 and it's an hour and 38 minutes long. And it's little tagline says, two teens who live the same day repeatedly enabling them to create the map. So pretty much it's just um, two people throughout the movie. You've got um, Margaret and Catherine Newton plays her and then Mark and that's played by Kyle Allen so Mark wakes up it's like Groundhog's Day he wakes up and lives the same day over and over again he does not know why he is doing it um, he just knows that he is so um, he tries to make the most out of his day and then one day he is going, um, he goes to the pool to, um, I guess like rescue this girl who's about to fall in. Um, and another girl swoops in and rescues her. And he now knows that there's someone else who is living the same day that he is. So he finally meets Margaret and they decide to make a map of all of the perfect things. He shows her all of these like perfect things that he finds that he has found within the day. So they decide to make a map of all of the perfect things. Since they are stuck in reliving this day over and over again, they thought it would be something cool to do. So that's what they set out to do. And of course, I mean, it's two teenagers, you know, there's going to be like love and all of this. And so, um, I don't want to give too much away. It was a cute little movie. You know, I'll give it two thumbs up. I really liked it. Um, it was very interesting. It kept me interested. Um, I mean, it wasn't like groundbreaking or anything like that. But it's like when you realize, you know, what the, why the day is, the way that it is, and all this stuff it like oh you know it pulls at your heartstrings and stuff so yeah if you got Amazon Prime and want to watch this I would totally totally recommend that so for my square I made um, the same square that I always make it is by Maria's blue crayon it's the granny square 2.0 and then my appliques for my letters are by the Moogly blog and I will, of course, put links down below to everything that I talk about. So here is my M square. I had um, quite a bit of trouble with the M, like the going back this way. It's just, I just wasn't paying attention, I think, to the pattern. Because once I sat down and really, really paid attention, it went smoothly. So for the letters, as always, I'm using all of this yarn in fruit salad. You can see it's got all these specks of all these different colors. And this right here is a Yarn B Mini Maker in the color yellow. So for, I go eight rounds to um, make my square. And it is like the Mini Makers, let's see if I, I think I put them up. The Mini Makers are I mean, there's just like a tiny little ball left, and that's just enough to help, you know, sew it up. So, so there's my M square. It's moving right along. And the movie that I've chosen to watch for my end, I had quite a bit of problems finding one that I wanted to watch that I hadn't already seen. And I thought it was looking like I was going to have to just choose one that I'd already seen before. But then I stumbled across one called Needful Things. 
I am going to rent it off of Amazon Prime. Um, I think it's like renting a movie is like $3.99 or something like that. But it is a book that I always wanted to read by Stephen King of the same name, Needful Things. Um, I used to own the book. I think I donated it. Yeah, I just never got around. I mean, it's like massively huge. I just never got around to reading it. So I'm like, this is the perfect time. I'll just watch the movie and be done with it. Okay, so that's all I have for you today. So in a couple of weeks, I'll see you back right here and we will discuss needful things and I'll let you know what I thought about it. And I will tell you my O movie and show you my in block. Okay, I'll see you guys later. Bye.